Let me just get some dirt on it and get that off for you. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, Manaroo. Hey. Well, we had a bit of a rough night last night. Sleeping is hard for Rena in the camper van. For whatever reason. For whatever reason. Haven't quite figured it out. It's very dark in there. Um, we have her sound machine. She's sleeping in the same bassinet she sleeps in at home. Uh, with her sleep sack, everything pretty much just the same, but not the same, obviously, because she can't sleep here. So she would fall asleep for five or 10 minutes and then wake up. Um, she did that like six times or something at two in the morning. Um, but the good news is we are soon gonna have some breakfast. We're making a hash. So we got the potatoes simmering here. And I would just like to say, this is my aesthetic right here. Look at that. Got some onion and bell pepper and zucchini going in there. Also got some sausage going in there. Got some cheese going in there. Got some eggs going in there. I'm gonna have some leftovers, I think. Stage two. Ready for breakfast, Ren? There's our hash. Just gotta put some cheddar on top. Pan I have isn't great, so. Kara got a fried egg. I got. Egg pile? Egg pile. Yeah. And. <laughs> Thanks, Renna. Thanks. Travis always looking for excuses to use his chainsaw. Yep. I feel like it's sprinkling. Just got a drop, I think. Hey, sugar, what you wearing? This is Rena's first time swimming and her first time visiting a lake, I think. She's got the cutest bathing suit on. Yeah. And a little fishing hat. Yeah. <laughs> it looks like she has no neck from the back. <laughs> Necklace baby. Nichols Lake, it's kind of the Offshoot, Fam Bam, Beach. It's on kind of a peninsula, so I think this connects out to this. Um, can actually kind of walk down that way to find out, but I don't know if we'll do that. Anyways, definitely like Nichols Lake. Yeah. Oh man, do you want to sit? Should go for it? Okay, we're gonna sit down. Oh, wow. Probably don't need to eat no. any of this seaweed. Look, there's water, see? <gasps> yeah. Not quite sure what to make of it. Yeah. First sand in a row. <laughs> <laughs> you count that as a hundred food? <laughs> What are you supposed to worry about keeping your child from eating sand? Is it just like one of those A for effort kind of things? You splashed yourself in the face once? It was like... <laughs> it's very surprising. <laughs> it's like the tub! Yeah, it's like your tub. Where we take bath time. It's the biggest tub ever, huh? <laughs> <laughs> she likes it. Swimming's yeah. fun. You gonna be on the swim team like Mama? Maybe you'll hate it like Mama. <laughs> I just want to be on the splash team, guys. Yeah. <laughs> want to try some fishing? Little beach burrito. So we've had worms sitting in our refrigerator for two weeks for this moment. Um, we even brought them all the way here. They've been in the camper van for two days and we forgot them on our walk down to the lake. So Travis is fishing with a lure. So we'll see if we catch anything. We weren't really anticipating catching anything anyway. This is just an exercise in having fun. Just gotta throw the cast and pull a couple times. Make sure it works. Yeah, make sure it works. <laughs> there he goes. 
the maiden voyage of his new pole. Did you catch our dinner? <laughs> we forgot to bring tin foil for the loaded baked potatoes we were gonna make, so we don't have anything for dinner now. So the pressure is on, Trav. You need to catch some fish for us to eat, or we'll go hungry. Yeah. Right. There was a fish that wanted to oh, see it coming. Yeah? yeah. Huh. It's really clear out there. Time for lunch. You want a BLT TNA? BLT TNA. Seriously, some monster sandwiches in here. Bacon, lettuce, tomato, onion, turkey, avocado, cheddar. So it is six o'clock on Saturday night. See, hey, Ren. Hi, Ren. And uh, yeah, we are we are packing up. We're gonna go home. We were supposed to stay another night, um, but we're just not feeling it, huh? <laughs> yeah, we miss our bed and we miss our dog and we miss our mostly just our bed i think for renna so we're packing up and we just decided to call it quits a day early so we're heading home tonight instead of tomorrow morning we're going home ren we're going home it's like a little disappointing but also if it's not fun it's not fun like that's the whole point is to have fun like it's a it's a vacation if you're no longer enjoying it like <laughs> what, what are you doing so um yeah we're going home we're gonna pick up our dog from my parents house tonight we're gonna sleep in our own beds tonight yeah it just was getting progressively worse with her napping or lack thereof um <laughs> like cranky baby cranky us i feel like she didn't nap really kind of the whole weekend and like her nighttime sleep was not great either after we got back from our last walk which was like five o'clock we tried to give her a banana and she just like lost her mind <laughs> she's just like wailing eating this banana yeah. <laughs> and travis was also practically crying holding her <laughs> while she's crying both of them covered in banana <laughs> it's just like a sad sight too much honey mm. listen it's a vacation not torture how are you feeling at this point tired sweaty glad we did it glad we got out there I'm glad we went like I had fun it was fun it was fun like I wouldn't have not gone if we could go back in time I would still go on this trip um, but also, I think it's just time to go home. So that's what we're doing. Yeah, it was fun until the banana, and then we made the decision to go home and continue having fun instead of... Stay force. there and be yeah. miserable. Well, it's not over a fire or camp stove, but we got our French toast. One final camping meal at home. I got two more slices coming. How's it feel to be back home? Good. It does feel good. Coffee in the woods is nice, but vanilla caramel lattes are good too. Yeah, we're spoiled. <laughs> yeah. And uh, we got this delicious French toast happening. Yeah. See, you can get all the joys of the woods in the comfort of your own home. Yeah. I'm going to show you my French toast. Really, French toast for me is just a vehicle for powdered sugar. Oh yeah, look at that. That's what I'm talking about.